they are the biggest representations of Jesus I've ever seen in my life. And I can't wait to watch them just like come together and be that beautiful like radiance. It's gonna be crazy. But I'm um, excited. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
Boy, you fill my head with pieces Of a song I can't get out Can I be close to you? Take it to a moment Where the fields are painted gold And the trees are filled with memories Of the feelings never told When the evening pulls the sun down this holy estate which is the deepest mystery of experience and which is the very essence of divine love. Grayson, will you have Chandler to be your wedded wife, to live together after God's ordinance in the holy estate of matrimony? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep yourself only for her as long as you both shall live. I will. And Chandler? <laughs> will you have Grayson to be your wedded husband? To live together after God's ordinance in the holy estate of matrimony. Will you love him, comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep yourself only for him for as long as you both shall live? Marriage is words that come to life. And marriage begins by giving our word. You cannot join into this covenant relationship with one another without giving your word. And Chandler and Grayson have written their vows and they will share them with one another. Chandler, I have been granted the privilege of knowing you for the past five years. Over this time period, I've watched you grow and develop in every area. When I look at you today, I get a glimpse of the woman God is preparing for you. The woman God is preparing you to be. God is making you to become an incredibly special woman. It is exciting, and I want to be a part of that every single day. You're the most selfless and kind person I've ever met. Loving you comes incredibly natural. But loving you in the way that I'm supposed to, in the way that God intended, is not an easy task. So I promise to trust God, to align my heart with His. I promise to surrender to His will. I promise to lead you, to 
provide direction and to guide you through for every season we walk through. And when I don't know which way to turn, I promise to turn you. I promise to honor you, to take pride in you, to respect you as a worthy companion and partner. I promise to always make you feel special, to constantly pursue you and embrace your individuality. I promise to value and encourage the unique gifts that God has instilled on me. I promise to comfort you in hard times and be your strength in your weak. I promise that your joy would become my joy. I promise to make every day new. To make passion and adventure a part of our everyday life. I promise to love you unconditionally. To love you when I don't feel loved. I promise to be slow to anger quick to forgive. I promise to lead you like Jesus does. I promise to love you like Jesus does. Your triumphs and failures, and joy and sorrow for all good. Grace. For the past 23 years, my deepest prayer has been that the Lord would show me what it means to be a godly wife, one that would be most honoring to Him. But since the moment we decided to take that leap from such a strong friendship and pursue love, my prayer shifted a little. I pray that if the Lord had chosen me to be your wife, that he would continue to mold and make my heart to be the kind of woman and wife that you deserve, and one that God designed for your heart alone. And if he did not choose me to be your wife, he would have a lot of explaining to do. <laughs> Grayson, as your wife, I promise to love you, not only because you're my husband, but because you're an individual that was perfectly designed by God to be loved, cherished, and honored. I promise to pursue you, listen to you, and value your thoughts and desires as greater than my own. I promise to challenge you and always remind you of the incredible strengths and talents you have to offer to so many. And though your flaws are few, I promise to remind you that yes, it is true, you are not always right, <laughs> and that the Lord's power is made perfect in your weaknesses. I promise you all of my heart and all of my affection. I promise to forgive you and always ask for forgiveness. I promise to pray for you and always remind you of the Lord's unconditional love for you. I promise to ask the Lord daily that he would continue to mold our marriage and our heart into one that is most pleasing to him. I promise to value life with you as an avenger, one that's ever-changing, yet grounded in a passionate friendship and love that no matter what may happen, it is to never be broken. I promise to hold your hand through the happiest days and hold it even tighter through the hard ones. Grayson, I promise to always remember that your heart in this marriage is not just my own, but it is a gift so graciously given to us by God that deserves my utmost love and commitment to all the days of life. Grayson, you place this ring on Chandler's finger. Will you repeat after me? With this ring, with this ring, I marry you. I marry you. Let it ever be to us. Let it ever be to us. A symbol of our love. A symbol of our love. And repeat after me. With this ring, with this ring I marry you. Let it ever be to us a symbol of our love. By the authority committed unto me as a minister of the gospel, I declare that they are husband and wife according to the ordinance of God and the laws of this state. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. And Grayson, you may kiss the bride. Thank you.
We're married. <laughs> We're the flat. The deep blue sea, we gonna sail across the ocean, you and me. I want to you nice, honey, you and I. We gonna float up to heaven in the deep blue sky. We gonna look down on creation, you and I. So if you wanna make it rain, you make it pour. You started flying toward the sun, you wanted more, more, more. And you're We're gonna take a bus, we're gonna go downtown together, the two of us Oh, one of these nights, honey, you and I We're gonna beat the ones that float on by We're gonna float until forever, you and I So if you wanna make it rain, you make it pour You started flying towards the sun You wanted more, more, more And you're my Towards the sun, you wanted more, more, more. 